All right, folks, good news here. I'm able to hook up the telescope to my planetary software program here. I use Earth Centered Universe. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So you'll go over here to the telescope drop down menu and go to telescope type and general settings. That brings up another box here. You set the telescope type that you want to use. There's many different types of telescopes you can use. So I have the Mead Auto Star type telescopes. And I was able to find it on COM5. I'm using the USB cable in the back. And um, so I'm on COM5. And click OK. And then you come up here and you click on the little telescope icon. Kind of hard to see. But there's a telescope icon. You click on that. And then these boxes come up. And you're able to slew north, east, west, south gives you your right ascension and declination over here and it shows here I've already done a setup uh, where I've already aligned the telescope and the crosshair there is on the star Vega and so this is hooked up by way of a USB cable so there's the USB port this is a USB to serial adapter here here's the, uh, the product there the USB to serial adapter there's the software for the driver that came with it so the USB cable over to the serial end, which is hooked to another serial, to a 505 cable, and up to the Auto Star hand controller here, to that port there on the left, the little 505 cable, and then of course the Auto Star is hooked up to the computer on the telescope there. Uh, telescopes in the box there, uh, but so this is just to run the motors. So I'll show you how it works. So. I've clicked the telescope icon, so now the telescope is activated. It shows me that I've centered on the star Vega there after my alignment procedure. And so now the great thing is I can go to any object I want, any obscure object. I can load the uh, comets and asteroids and stuff like that. So really obscure things. I can pick anything I want, but let's say I want to find this comet here. Let's click on the comet. The info box comes up over here. I click on center scope. Crosshair starts moving across the screen over to the comet and you can hear the motors running on the telescope over there. It's pointing at the comet. So it's doing its fine adjustments here and then it'll center on the telescope on center on the comet and then the telescope will give me a beep to let me know that it's ready and centered on the comet. And there it is. So if we look in the eyepiece right now, if we were outside, you should be able to see the comet. Awesome. So this will help me find things really fast when I'm out in the field. Of course, I could find these things myself, but this is much better. Thank you.